Tonight's top EU stories from the UNIT website include Spain begs for additional time to fix its broken finances. Support for the EU plunges to an all-time low. MEPs divided over US-EU trade talks. The European dream is in dire need of a reality check. Plus, what is the Bradbury Pound and why should we bring it back? I'm Rick Timmis and this is the Unit Nightly News. First, from our homepage, economic forecasters in Spain said the country would climb out of its bitter recession in 2014, but needed two extra years to meet the European Union's target for reining in its public deficit. The latest official unemployment figures on Thursday showed that Spain's jobless rate surged past 27% in the first quarter of this year. Hundreds of people rallied outside the Parliament in central Madrid late Thursday in the latest of two years of street protests in anger at the crisis. Figures from Eurobarometer, the EU's own polling organisation, suggest that anti-Brussels feeling has spread far beyond Britain and is rising in both poor and better off nations throughout the EU. Tim Aker of the anti-Brussels campaign group Get Britain Out said millions of people across the continent are seeing their livelihoods go up in smoke thanks to the EU's fanatical belief in the euro and ever closer union. MEPs are divided over whether the European culture sector should be excluded from talks on an EU-US trade agreement. The International Trade Committee is calling for the EU's priorities to include the opening up of the public procurement and financial services sectors. This article goes on to highlight some very interesting aspects of this developing US-EU trade agreement. This is a story that needs to be monitored carefully. The EU has lost the support of two-thirds of its citizens, yet its leaders won't wake up. This article takes a long, cold, hard look at the European Union and asks, is it time this project had a reality check? A quick Google on the term fractional reserve banking brings back some amazing information that I and perhaps many of you are not aware of. This letter from the UK column discusses the idea of a national currency backed and issued by the British government via the Treasury. This new money would be free from the interest and debt charges incurred by the government currently as it borrows money into existence via the bond markets through the Bank of England. Sounds crazy, but this has actually happened once before. In 1914, the UK government issued the Bradbury Pound as legal tender. This letter from the UK column explains the concept more fully and provides links to an amazing video. This is definite one to read. Today in our video library, as you know, we have written and produced a new documentary, Betrayed, which we have submitted to the Operation Paul Revere contest at Infowars.com. We thought it would be interesting to take a look at some of the other videos that have been produced and so through the month of May I will pick out a daily operation Paul Revere contest entry and provide a link to it on YouTube. Now, speaking of YouTube, you could really help us a great deal with our documentary and contest entry by subscribing to our channel, rating our film Betrayed, either like or dislike, but I'd prefer like please, and most importantly sharing it with as many people as you possibly can. So without further ado, today's video which I have added to our Operation Paul Revere YouTube playlist is Broken Boards, produced, directed and filmed by Imagination. I'm Rick Timmis, reporting for the Unit Nightly News. I'll see you soon. You can get lots more news stories and information on our website, theunit.com. 
You can get in touch with us there and we particularly welcome your letters and points of view. You can follow us on Twitter. Our Twitter username is the E unit. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for all of our regular updates. You can join me and the rest of the team for interactive discussion and debate on Google Plus at any time. Are you looking for a public speaker for your event? Our public speakers are happy to come and discuss Britain's relationship with the EU in your area at no cost. If you would like to add interest and value to your group event, then get in touch with us via the words section of our website. Join us in our live question time style online show, The Unit Interactive. Broadcast live on our website, theunit.com, and globally via thehangoutshow.com. Join our community on Google+, and you can be part of the wider public voice, united in freedom, liberty, and independence. Simply join our community, the unit on Google+, links to the community page are below. <laughs>